Welcome. In front of me is a Xiaomi Mi 10 T Lite, and today I'll show you how to record your screen on this device. So to get started, let's pull down the notification panel and find a toggle for a screen recording. And it looks like it's on the second page right over here. So before you actually tap on it, I urge you to hold the toggle. And from here, we can actually tap on the settings and change a couple of things. So we have number one, the resolution at the very top. And it looks like it's set to the highest one, so that's good. Then we have bitrate uh, in here. It can go higher, it can go lower depending on how much storage you want it to take up. Uh, if you want a higher fidelity uh, footage, for instance like for games, uh, I would advise you to go for like 24, uh, 32 even. Uh, anything above that I think will be just kind of lost, uh, but you can check it out if, uh, if that is the case or not for whatever your need might be. Uh, now, the way you are going to see it probably clear clearest is in in areas where there is motion uh, when for instance when you pan out somewhere uh, with a low bit rate it will start looking pixelated and it will gain that uh, that quality after like a couple seconds of standing in a way still so a higher bit rate means that it's gonna keep that sharpness uh, either gain it quicker or basically never lose it so can go higher if you want to or lower if you just want to the footage to take as little space as possible and quality isn't necessarily a concern here um, then we have orientation I would keep it as it is uh, it will just uh, either you can lock it to position of the device um, as it is right now so if your device is in landscape it's going to record in landscape and if it's in portrait it's going to record in portrait or you can set it to be locked in a specific way you have a sound source uh, we have um, mute, uh, mic, or system, no both if you wanted that. So sadly, you only have to choose between one or the other. Um, so obviously, select whichever one you want. Uh, then we have fixed frame rate. I would consider it to be, this to be checked on. Um, without fixed frame rate, it will change frame rates depending, I guess, on what you're opening up. And then we have actual frame rate and unfortunately we cannot go to 60 so we're stuck at 30 and with this option i would advise you to go for 30 uh, basically the max option uh, 24 not much of a difference uh, if you hear that crap with cinematic experience yeah sure cinematic is 24 when it's pre-rendered uh, here it's going to be rendered on a device so it won't be that and 15 will just look like an utter garbage um, so i would strongly advise you to not even consider this option and its existence so 30 is in my opinion the only option that exists here and that's what you should go for and then we have a couple other options so recording option lock screen to end so if you like the device uh, recording will end uh, show touch gestures whenever you're recording and you touch on the screen it will show a gray dot a semi-transparent just to signify where you've been touching the display uh, visual navigation buttons uh, you can check this on or not show uh, prompts when pressing home button menu and background or back buttons and then the last one uh, go back to screen recording so this is i believe when you stop recording uh, it will take you to the page before uh, this one so it will take you to this page now as you can see there is no other options here so we can leave it and all we need to do is simply tap on a toggle and as you can see it will start recording and whatever i will do right now will be recorded by the device um, i can open up apps if i wanted to and it will also record them with the limitation of things like netflix um, i'm gonna try to maybe demonstrate this uh, i guess i can't really uh, but yeah once you're done uh, simply tap on this thing choose the square to stop it and as you can see it gets saved and like i said before um, the footage gets saved to the video recording application right here so you can open it up from here i'm gonna mute it in case i was recording my voice so you will now see basically everything that i was doing over uh, while recording
and going back to what I was saying, uh, some apps will block you from recording, things like I said Netflix. If you try to record on Netflix, um, all you will get is just a black image and, and nothing on top of that. Um, that's just Netflix way of trying to prevent piracy. Um, so keep that in mind. Um, but yeah, that is basically how you would record your screen. And if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.